Hello, DJ Vic Paper with you. Welcome back to Logic Pro 10 Beginners Course. And in this uh, lesson, we're going to take a look at the uh, vertical auto zoom feature right here. This guy right here. One of the last buttons for us to pretty much cover. We've, we've done a good job of covering pretty much everything on top of the board here. Vertical auto zoom. So right now you can see my tracks displayed you know the small little arrangement we've been working out working with throughout the uh, course here and they're all kind of nice and neatly organized right here so when I click on vertical auto zoom watch what happens all the tracks that you have that you're working on or that are available for you resize themselves and automatically go ahead and fit the screen and real estate that you have available so let me open up a uh, clip editor here. I'm going to double click. Well, let me take this guy off actually. So come on, work with me. There we go. Just got to get the mouse working. I think I need to change the battery on this guy. All right, so there you have your your audio tracks or your regions. Now let's click back on vertical auto zoom. What happens now is if I move the bottom portion, the editor below, if I re resize it or move it around in any way, do you see how the real estate up here kind of, it doesn't get it doesn't disappear or get um, pulled over. It just resizes itself to stay within my line of sight for the project. That's the benefit of having vertical auto zoom. If we take this guy off, now if I start to resize, I'm just going to cover up and lose the line of sight for the uh, regions and the auto tracks. So vertical auto zoom, just kind of a nice way to keep your screen real estate you know, depending on what, what you need to see in your arrangement or in your project, all right here in front of you. So let me get rid of this guy and see how they're all perfectly sized and then back to a smaller area right there. So that's the vertical auto zoom feature in Logic Pro 10. Let's move on to our next lesson.